Congratulations, Executor. Your success has brought us the promise of hope against the Zerg. However, we face a new threat within our own ranks. In your absence, Judicator Alderis and an entire legion of Kali survivors from Ayr have begun an open revolt against us. By the gods, this is ill news indeed. Why would Alderis betray us so? He and his ilk believe that it was wrong to have abandoned Ayr and consorted with our people. Their prejudices have driven them to perpetuate the Conclave's sins against us. Even now, Alderis and his loyalist Templar forces are preparing to attack our citadel. I can scarcely believe this. As if the Zerg were not enough. Matriarch, are you certain of this? All too certain, young Templar. Executor, as Matriarch of the Dark Templar and custodian of this world, I hereby order you to terminate Judicator Alderis and quell this untimely uprising without delay. There will be no dissent among us while the Zerg are poised to strike. There's something amiss here. The Matriarch has always been a wise and gentle soul. Though there is some merit in her decision, this is very unlike her. That may well be. But right now, we have a friend to kill. May Adun forgive us. Be advised, Executor. Our forces are divided. Alderis has taken control of our Templar warriors and arbiters. It is possible that he may even send Archons not against not us. Minerals. Fear not, comrades, for we have Archons of our own. Should the dire need arise, all Dark Templar may merge to become Dark Archons. Though we sacrifice our warriors in doing so, only the might of the Dark Archons can match the forces of Aldaris. <laughs> Instructions. A 
I'm waiting instructions. sooner die, Darkwan, than tarnish the memory of Ayer by joining with you. Your fate was sealed the moment your matriarch allied herself with the Queen of Blades. Those of us still loyal to Ayer will never be slaves to Kerrigan and her broods. Alderis, be reasonable. Kerrigan has changed. She no longer seeks to enslave anyone. Do not force us to destroy you. You can no longer afford to be so naive, Artanis. While you were securing the crystals, I discovered that your matriarch has been harboring a dark secret. She has been manipulated by- I have no time for this. What have you done? I just cleaned up your mess, Frotas. Don't be so squeamish. Wretched creature. This was our Protoss matter. You had no right to interfere. Be gone from this world. You are no longer welcome among us. Fine. I've done what I came here to do. I've ensured the destruction of the renegade Cerebrates, and I used you to do it. Have fun, mighty Protoss. We'll be seeing each other again. Real soon. <laughs> <laughs> 